Where was I? Ah, there was once a ferocious two-headed sea serpent. Mildred was its name. <laughs> or was it Monstro? Well, anyway, one of the serpent's heads liked to eat ships. <laughs> But the other ad liked to eat fish. <laughs> one ad wanted one thing, the other ad wanted something else. <laughs> and then it became obvious they needed to communicate. I say, old boy, wouldn't it be better if we worked together? Jolly good idea, old sport. <laughs> After you, old chap. <laughs> Your turn, old bean. And from then on, that double-headed sea serpent never went short of his fish and ships. <laughs> Maybe I was being a little too pushy. I guess I could have spoken up. We shouldn't be pulling in opposite directions, Cranky. You're right. Now, what if I just... That it, Cranky. Oh, up a bit. Left a bit. Almost there. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, shipmates. Communication. Oh, it's a wonderful thing. Oh, woo, woo. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to Salty's story, Cranky and Carly learned about working together and pulling in the same direction. You take this one, Cranky. Thank you, Carly. There's a ship over there needs unloading. <laughs> no problem, Cranky. Two cranes working in perfect harmony. <laughs> Don't you mean three cranes? <gasps> what? So now you speak? You've been standing there silent all these years, Big Mickey. And you've never said a single word. Well, you've never said a single word to me either. Communication? Ah, uh, just like I was saying. <laughs> Welcome to the team, Big Mickey. You three cranes will be just like those three musketeers. <laughs> all for one, and one for all! <laughs>